Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back to another YouTube video. And then today I'm going to be showing you my uh, rodeo stuff. Um, uh, this rodeo stuff back here. <clears throat> I will be showing you what, what I do for, you know, for, for fun times. But I will be doing it here pretty soon. So this is a rodeo. You can see it says Austin Tyrone Horse. No, that is not my name. But that's my name of my brothers. So I have, well, I should show you the glove first. So I have my glove here. This is my riding glove. This is uh, where I put it on here. Let me show you how to put it on. Move the stuff here. Okay. All right. So this is my riding glove. Um, so what you do is you put it on just like a normal glove. And then these there's um velcro here so you just want to take your your whatever you want to call it part stick it on there like that and it'll stick um <clears throat> and then you can it just basically feel com comfortable but this one's small and i might have to get another one later sooner or later but you have your riding glove here Oh yeah, and I always have a sh second one in my bag. Right here. Oh. Now, this is my rope. Right here, this is my um, steer rope here. This is what I use when I ride steers. Um, but not anymore because uh, I'm in junior bull riding now. But this is what I use. <clears throat> I use this uh uh, rope here and then i also have one of these uh nice whatever you want to call it i don't know what these are called but <clears throat> they go on the side of your rope right here here's the other part and then my bells here got this one at um tnr for 7.99 then this one i've always had but but yeah i got these ones and then it's actually supposed to go this way because you know this this side right here you you put your pinky at the side right here so that's what can can you tell it's a left uh, hand <clears throat> so you guys are gonna be on my right so it's this way but I usually, I usually ride on my left so anyway yeah all right next one next item on my um just move this stuff chaps so these are my brother's chaps um he rode i forgot how many years ago i think it was three four years ago we were doing a <clears throat> it was for my dad's uh srp because he works for srp salt river project they were putting on a rodeo so this is where my brother rode his chaps <clears throat> and then <clears throat> oh, oh, let me close the door. Okay. So uh this one has been a really old chaps. I used to wear this when I was like three or four years old. <clears throat> Probably even younger. This is a really old chaps. I used to love wearing this and acting like I was being in the rodeo and stuff. So, but you know, it doesn't fit me no more. Uh, sorry, <clears throat> the camera's jiggly. <clears throat> but this one is mine. This chaps right here. This one's mine, but it doesn't really fit me anymore because um, I've, I've grown so much. So I think I'm gonna be buying a new, a new chaps here. So this is my old one, but it was my brother's, so, you know, it's not really mine. I just kind of used it. On to the next island. Um, this, this is my brother's uh, little tiny <clears throat> um, vest right here he used. So he, here he is right here. See, here's my brother right here. Okay, hey, guys, this is my old vest well, when I was, like, when I was running a sheep. 
This is my old vest, and now I'm nice. Probably gonna give this away. This was about, I think, 15 or 20. Probably give it away for like $10. It should be that much. Yeah, Whatever I can't find here. my vest right now, but but I'm just gonna use this for an example. Then here is Tristan's traps. Yeah, I showed show them that already. Traps. Did you show mine? Mm -hmm. All right, and then right here, and we then, got the and, rosin. Oh. This rosin. So this rosin is supposed to get your your rope nice and sticky. And, and when you like, rub it, it's supposed to be getting nice and hot. It's supposed to like hold it like this. Here's the, so that you're supposed to like um like you're supposed to put your thing through here. And you're supposed to hold and that that thing it holds on really tight so you'll hold it right there and then those ropes go around your thing your hand actually and then you just try to hang on and then for the next item we got my buckle we got miles's um buckle. sheep riding buckle. rope and i earned these two bells I'm gonna put like a monster ink so this was a thing. really old old, old i, sheep I earned that a long time ago but he's Maybe. not gonna be going into sheep riding no more. So he'll be going into he's gonna calf. be going into calves, calf riding. So I think I'm gonna know, use like I book. think I'm gonna use Tristan's bells. And then in here are like uh this one is uh, called spurs. Yeah. So what we're supposed to like help you stay in, like in shape or something like that. No, it's actually supposed to help you stay on, but you know some of these can get caught on your foot, so. There's the safety rules for these ones. And, and then, then, and and then, then last one. We got the riding helmet. Now, mm -hmm. this riding helmet I got from Goodwill for only $10. Um, we have another one, but it's really not that fittable for me or for Miles. So, we might I'll, have to I'll be doing this one. I think it's kind of fittable for me. Well, we'll I'll, I'll be using this one for a while. It actually goes, uh, looks pretty good on me right now. Get it on. So... I do this right here. That looks like a football helmet, right, guys? It does look like a football helmet, but I put on these straps right here. I don't even know where they are, but they're somewhere around here, but I can't feel them. All right, so this is what I'm going to be wearing during riding. Um, but like I said, all you need is gloves, a rope, a helmet for safety, a vest for safety, or, and or if you really, or if you, or if you're really tough enough, you can just wear a cowboy hat. Yeah, or you can wear a cowboy hat as well. You don't have to wear helmets. And if you want to be extra safety, you can wear these helmets. Cause they look, cause, cause they look, they're like hardable. Whoa, I almost fell out. Anyway, and then they're gonna yeah. call your name up. Like, say you're gonna wear like one of these. Like, they're gonna wear a number on you, and you're gonna wear a number on your vest. They're gonna like right here. They're gonna stick in the back of right here. Right here, they're gonna stick in the back. Sorry, but they're gonna stick in the back. And then they're gonna put those numbers on you. And whatever number you are, you have to come up and ride a sheep, bull, or calf. Mm -hmm. And whether or not you're scared or not, you still have to face your fear just by riding something. Like I faced my fear, like no, a long didn't. time ago. I said, uh, when I was riding a rodeo, I said, hey, grandpa, that sheep has a big head and big horns. Yeah, but all you need is gloves. To keep you hanging on. <coughs> a rope. Chaps. Okay. Helmet or cow or, or cow hat. Cowboy hat. And spurs. So, and rosin to keep your... your. And chicken, did you explain them what the chaps are for? Yeah. What are they for? They are for... <clears throat> safeties because you know I mean if it's made out of like nice and hardly material and that bull steps on you it slides it slides his hooves will slide off of your your turn so you won't step on your leg or anything but you know there's my rodeo stuff I'll be doing plenty more rodeo stuff and here's our dad's collection as you can see I'm recording in the camera here's my dad's stuff not that very much. Here's my mom's side. Here's my dad's side. You can see he has earned a lot of buckles. Yeah, he's he's earned a lot of buckles from riding. And one of them and is mine. And then there's this one. 
A long time ago, this one was mine. Yeah, but there's a lot of, lot of. Like this one. On I'll just show you one. For example, like this. Do we got that one? We got my old one when I was. Uh, we got this. Uh, uh, I can't read that. Get or or get her done. Get her done. I think that's what it was supposed to say. And then my dad has a lot of cowboy hats up there that he uses. Sometimes. But that is pretty it. So guys, if you like, if you like this video, leave a like. Oh, and there's the helmet that Tristan was talking about that doesn't fit him. Oh, yeah, right that's here. the helmet right here. This is the one that doesn't fit me, but it fits Miles. So look. All right. And then this goes on. And then you put those. And then you put this, this stuff on. Like this. Yeah. Here, I'll do it for you. Like this. Mm -hmm. Hold on, I'll show it from the side. All right. If you see those things that buckle on, that's what you do. Yeah, you buckle these on really tight. There's a button right here. You just push. You put, you put these in the button. It's kind of hard to put on. Damn it. See? Hold She's on. trying to, like, put I'm it I'm trying in. to put it on right now. Just to show you guys. All right. So this is what it's supposed to be. So, look, at least it keeps you from right here. It keeps you, like, your safety. It's for safety and everything. So, yes, this is made of hard plastic. So, in any case, right. when the bull steps on your head, it's going to hit this plastic, yep. which is really hard. <laughs> and then, the, the, the metal things then in then this middle. The face mask. So, when it hits your face, it's just going to hit this metal. Yep. So, this is for, like, your extra, just for, like, your safety of your head. So, guys, if in case you're going to ride a bull or a steer or a calf or a sheep, you wear this all the time. Or you can wear a cowboy hat. All right. Well, I guess that's, that's it for that's the video. Well, if you guys haven't, subscribe, like, like and ride and more ride bulls. And ride more. And, and ride, ride more, more bulls. And, be, and, and face your fear.